I loved the outdoors from day one. I was, you know, lived in Utah. I wanted to have a career in the outdoors. And when I figured out I loved like, you know, public relations and being in the outdoors, I always wondered, does the Division of Wildlife Resources have any jobs like that? And I was happy to find out they did. So that was the beginning for me. And then I knew I didn't want to be stuck in a cubicle my whole life. I wanted to be out here and do some fun things, artistic things, photography, working with people. And I found my perfect job. I am Scott Root. I am the um, Conservation Outreach Manager for the Utah Division of Wildlife Resources and I have worked for the division for a wonderful 30 years and I've loved every minute of it. So I'm standing here in a very important part uh, around Utah Lake. It's right where the Provo River is coming in and you'll notice that there are just trees lining the Provo River, very helpful for birds. And this is where it comes in, the cooler water of of uh, the Provo River entering the warmer water of Utah Lake. It's also a very important place for fish and a lot of anglers will hang out here because spawning fish are drawn toward that uh, the, the stream coming into the lake and they'll go up the stream to, to do their spawning activities. So a great place for birds. And you know like I say we'll have hundreds of anglers here sometimes and, and uh, even our our carp fishermen that come here, our commercial fishermen will come here, as you'll see, with their boats, and they remove a lot of carp, which helps uh, water quality, and will help our fish populations. That is a thing of beauty. <laughs> okay. So. And then that is an action word. So the white bass can be there. And it's probably sinking, so you could probably reel about this fast. Okay, so the Utah Division of Wildlife Resources, we have the, the great responsibility of managing the state's wildlife. It is not an easy job. We have some of the greatest biologists in the country here. So the division works with uh, the state parks and other organizations um, to make Utah Lake a better place. I mean, we manage the wildlife, so we have a lot of our aquatic biologists working, um, namely with the sport fish and the June sucker, which is an endangered species. We have white bass, largemouth bass, I mean, perch, crappie, uh, catfish, you know, child catfish, and bullhead catfish. I mean, the walleye, there's all types of species here that the anglers really enjoy catching. One of my favorite things to do, of course, is watching birds. I become a, a bird watcher basically from when I started working for the Division of Wildlife Resources. I love birds, and I come to Utah Lake because it's one of the most important birding areas in the state of Utah. I like to come here in the morning, you know, around 6 or 7 a.m., and I just enjoy it because the birds are just everywhere. I can't get over how colorful our birds are here. Every color of the rainbow, turquoise and red and orange and yellow and, you know, all the colors. A rooster pheasant alone has every color of the rainbow. One very important part of Utah Lake is the state park. I love the state park because of all of the outdoor recreation opportunities that are here. You can go kayaking, you can rent a paddleboard, you can go water skiing. You could come down here, they have a lot of green grass with picnic tables. You could camp down here. It's just a wonderful draw um, to bring people here and I, I would hope people would take advantage of the state park and all of the opportunities that are here. Utah Lake is my lake because I love wildlife and I love photography. You've got to come down here. It, it's, it's heaven. <laughs>